what's up guys welcome to today's tutorial in this video I would like to show you how to create drop downs in bootstrap you might have heard about drop downs in bootstrap and some of you may not know about drop downs so I would like to show you how to get started with drop downs so let's get started firstly I would like to take a div tag called container inside this container div I would like to take a h1 tag and give class called text center and give some text called hello guys now will create drop down in bootstrap save this and let's take another div tag for our actual drop down let's take this is a bootstrap class drop down class you can see here this all classes are bootstrap classes text center container you don't need to write this classes in a CSS externally the bootstrap is a ready-made framework CSS framework you can use these classes to make the websites more responsive so if you don't know about bootstrap don't forget to watch my previous video on introduction to bootstrap so now I would like to give a comment here because commenting is a good practice while developing anything so I have re I, ha I have written drop down here and I want this line to be commented so there is a shortcut key in sublime text editor called control backslash this way you can comment your lines inside this drop down I would like to take a button tag let's say type button and let's give some classes called btn default you could you could choose a uh, different classes as well B button primary btn primary btn success there are a lot of classes for buttons and even you can increase or decrease your button sizes so this way you can choose this button is for button drop down toggle and let's give the data toggle as drop down inside this button tag I would like to take span tag for the carrot and let's give the button name here called drop down let's save the changes in the editor let's hop to the browser and hit refresh you can see here it is working now below this button tag I want my unordered list for the drop down items let's take class as drop down menu inside this unordered list I'll take my list items inside this list item my anchor tag let's take this and let's give href as hash because it's a default value let's see our first markup language HTML let's give some more list items here CSS3 and let's take JavaScript 
these are the three basic web programming languages refresh the browser see you can have these three programming languages in your drop down menu HTML5, CSS3 and JavaScript what if I want to give a divider between two list items or two drop down items let's see how you can give now I would like to give a divider between a JavaScript and PHP let's copy down this paste it here remove JavaScript and write PHP hit the save button in the editor hop to the browser and hit refresh button open your drop down menu you can see here this small line between JavaScript and PHP this line is called divider which we have given using the class divider this is a bootstrap class divider which divide the true drop down menu items so this way you can divide the two menu items and you can also open your drop down menu at the right side of the window using this class called drop down menu right hit save up to the browser hit refresh button you can see here it is opening in a it is opening at the right side of the window using this way you can open your drop down menu at the right side of the window and if you want to open your drop down at the above position in an upward direction so you can give drop up here and change this drop down to drop up and here to drop up and here also change all drop down to drop ups hit refresh up to the browser oops it is not working now still not working you can see here just you need to rename your drop down class to drop up here it will open the drop down in an upward direction you can see here I can't scroll up my page here because it is already at the top of the page so you can easily give drop up or drop down class here using this way you can create drop downs in bootstrap hope you like this video please please subscribe my channel and like my videos thanks for watching this video i'll show you, i'll see you in the next video